Step one of the self-administration process. Leave the sheath on the butterfly needle. Remove the cap from the end of the infusion set, which attaches to the syringe containing the dissolved Synrise. Step two, attach the infusion set with a winged adapter to the syringe containing the dissolved Synrise. Step three, fill the tubing with dissolved Synrise by gently pushing the plunger of the syringe. Be careful not to spill the dissolved Synrise. This process replaces the air in the tubing with dissolved Synrise. Step four, apply a tourniquet above the site of the injection. Step five, prepare the injection site by wiping the skin well with an alcohol swab. Step six, as instructed by your healthcare provider, insert the butterfly needle of the infusion set tubing into your vein. Step seven, remove the tourniquet and make sure that the needle is in a vein. To avoid needle movement during the infusion, you may want to tape the winged adapter to your skin using medical tape. Inject the dissolved Synrise slowly over 10 minutes, approximately one milliliter per minute. Step eight. After infusing Synrise, remove the infusion set and cover the infusion site with a bandage. The amount of drug product left in the infusion set will not affect your treatment. Step nine. Dispose of all unused solution, the empty vials, the used needles and syringe in an appropriate container used for throwing away waste that might hurt others if not handled properly. Note, it is a good idea to record the lot number from the label of each vial of Synrise you use. Contact your healthcare provider if you have any questions about Synrise or about the preparation or self-administration of Synrise. Thank you for watching Synrise, a patient's guide to preparation and self-administration featuring the Mix2 vial transfer device.